Good morning, guys. So, this video is directed to everyone who says this is scary. Everyone who says this is too bold. I can't do this. Um, I'm not a makeup person. Um, this is not me. This palette is for those people who say I'm scared because that was me and it was scary. And look, look how pretty it is. It's not completely smoky. You can still see the little bit lid where it's a light color. It's still really bright. I can still wear it to work. Um, oh, first guys, for real, look at the shirt. Sorry, I'm late, but have you seen my brows? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It made me think of it whenever I close my eye. Do you see this? Okay. This is super easy, guys. I say this every day, but you guys know me. You know that, I mean, like, I'm seeing some, oh my gosh, fabulous looks with this that are terrifying to me because they're so smoky. Hey, Des, good morning. Maybe you can watch for more than 30 seconds. <laughs> um, this isn't scary. We can do this, right? Do you see that shimmer? I feel like this just does not do it justice. Okay, here's the deal. It's the last day to say my name, guys. It's the last day. It's the se Is today the 7th or is today the 8th? Maybe yesterday was the deadline? What's the date? Somebody tell me the date. Maybe it's the 8th. Maybe yesterday was the deadline. Maybe. I don't know. But here's the deal. Here's the kudos. You get the palette that is kind of scary, but it's not. You get a lipstick. Look at this today. I chose Swaga. It's one of my favorites, and I feel like... It's not the nude. It's not the shimmery pink. Um, it's amazing. Okay, it's the seventh. Perfect. Um, contest is over, so we'll see who wins. I don't know. I only did I did 12, which, I mean, I say only, but that's freaking huge. Okay, so here's the deal. You get one cream shadow and a cream shadow brush with this kudos. I actually today am wearing two cream shadows. First one is Rapturous. Second one is Bittersweet. Dust, go order it. You can even use white cash. If you don't want the kudos and you just want the palette, you can order it and use white cash. Free makeup right there. Okay, so um, just like every other day, do your transition and do your highlight before you do your glitter. So this is your transition color, this is your highlight color. So I'm just gonna take my blending brush, wipe off any glitter. This palette is unlike any other. It's glitter, guys. It's not shimmer, it's glitter. Okay, Friday will work. Okay, so with this one, just a little bit. I don't need a whole lot today because I'm going kind of bold with that purple, but I do need a transition color. I need something to kind of blend this into the top. A um, little bit more. We start light here. Um, but I want it pretty dramatically, not a complete line, but I wanted it kind of dramatic today. Um, only because I want to show you that it can be a little dramatic without being scary, okay? So there's that one. Transition color. I don't know why I'm holding two mirrors. This one right here. Um, I just put this brush, the liner shader, right here. And I'm just going to go above it. And then I'm going to go in the corner. Guys, this is a super simple look. Because remember, if I can do this, anyone can do this. Okay? Anyone can do this. I am utterly convinced. Okay. So, I've got my transition it's just a real light transition, and then I've got my highlight on, okay? So what I wanna do now is I wanna go to my cream shadow. Because with the glitter, um, it can be put on by itself. It can be put on with just straight primer, but it's gonna work really, really well if you have some kind of base. So you guys have seen me use the white liner. Um, you can also use the cream shadows. That's why this kudos comes with the cream shadows. It's kinda genius, okay? This is the Rapturous. You guys have seen me do this one with like my deluxe brush where I just like swirl it around and put it on there and it's not crazy bold. I'm gonna kinda put it on a little bold today. I'm not even gonna lie. It's gonna go on a little bold, okay? It's gonna go on bold. So let me get this. And here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just going to pack it in over here, but on the other side, again, we're gonna try to get the same on both eyes, but probably ain't gonna happen. You saw it yesterday. But I didn't care and no one said anything. No one came up to me and said, um, oh, by the way, your eye makeup doesn't match. No one said that. Can you believe it? Because I really felt like I did not do an amazing job yesterday. Here's what something did amazing happen. And if you are this person and you're watching this video, 
I truly want to shout you out because I want to message you because yesterday you took me off guard and um, I asked you your name completely lost it before I even left because I was so um, taken back so I'm in line at Chipotle and the most gorgeous girl says oh my gosh I know you I watch your makeup videos on Facebook <laughs> like I'm like in that moment I am so terrified that um, I don't even know what to say because one I wanted to say um, I need to take my couple lessons from you because your brows are on fleek and your contouring and highlight is perfection right there on a person okay so I'm truly just packing this on here I'm getting it pretty heavy um, and like I wanted to say all these things but all I could say was oh my gosh thank you so much I really appreciate you following me and so I did ask her her name but I lost it <laughs> And I don't know if she's a friend of mine or if she just follows me. I don't know if she sells unique. I don't, I don't know. Um, guys, and please, if you're my friend on Facebook and I don't know you because you only post pictures of your kids and then I see you somewhere and you don't have your kid, just please know that I love you guys all, but I have over 2,000 Facebook friends. So sometimes it's kind of hard for me to recognize everybody, especially if you only post pictures of your kids. Um, okay, so... I feel like we have stippled this on pretty good. I think it's dark enough. Whoa, I almost put it in my palette. See, I'm nervous even talking about. Okay, so here's the thing is I know people watch my videos, but I don't like to believe that people watch my videos because <laughs> it makes me nervous. Okay, we're gonna see if that's dark enough right there. Okay, so now's when you're gonna come in and put the purple on, okay? So the purple is this one right here. Do you see that? Boom, bang. So if you are the girl from Chipotle, I would love for you to shout yourself out or message me so that I can actually tell you how amazingly gorgeous you are. So put this in here. I'm putting it on pretty heavy, okay? You see the shimmer? You're gonna wanna pat this, don't swipe it. I keep grabbing that other mirror. I have a mirror in my hand. Okay. And then just keep patting it in there. I'm going all the way across today, kind of a little bit in the middle, right here. Why does this eye always look so much better? I just don't understand. I just don't understand. We're gonna try to get it though. We are going to try to, um, cause I don't really wanna blend this, but. Okay, here's the thing guys is you can screw this up, it's okay. Because I did the other eye perfectly and then I talk while I'm doing this one and it goes all haywire. <laughs> yes, don't forget the makeup. I just put this back in my transition color a little bit and put it in there. Like I did. For like a week? For two weeks. Yes. That kid, okay. We're gonna try to get this kind of similar. We'll find, we'll, we'll, we'll see if I can do this the same as I did the other eye. Okay, so back to my cream shadow brush. Okay, cause I got the purple in there. But you see how that one's way more blended and way better? This is where I'm gonna come in with that second color of cream shadow. Cause this was rapturous with the purple. And then this is bittersweet. This color is gorgeous. If you love a cut crease, you will love this color. right here is well it's at today and then I'm gonna put it on here and again I'm just patting it on here as well you see how it's kind of getting that blended effect like this eye over here the other eye was so um, like gracefully done and like it just was so easy do you guys okay do you guys have a hard eye and an easy eye because I never noticed so much that I did until I'm doing this process and then I'm like what did I just do like did I really do both eyes or did Dryden do one eye? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Mom, Nothing. I heard you say something. I said my one eye looks really good. My one eye looks like a little bit like it needs help. So I wondered if I did one eye and you did one eye. I've done your makeup before and it looked perfect. You His remember idea that? Yes. Uh -huh. it, was, it was perfect. Like your hair. Did you want to show them your hair? 
Look, look at his hair. My makeup was perfect like his hair. <laughs> it looked better than my hair. I love you. Um. Okay, whoa. Whoa. Kyle is not with us right now. He's already left for work. Okay. It's a lip glossing. Go get dressed, bud. Go tell Brittany it's time to wake up. Okay, so this then is what I'm going to do on the lid. I'm just going to do the uh, reverse side of my sponge, sponge brush. I'm going to get it pretty bold on there, okay? Kind of tap it off just in case there's extra, but it works. Do you see that? This is amazing, guys. I'm going to put a little bit more. Do my eyes look somewhat more similar? I got to blend that top or do something with it. <laughs> And I didn't even put any liner. I didn't put any liner. Um, let me do this purple more down here. Right there maybe? I don't know. And now we'll come back in with this. Guys, makeup is like um, trial and error for me. Um, not always does it come out perfectly. Um, sometimes it needs help. <laughs> Sometimes I gotta break out my concealer and fix it. There have been times when I have taken it completely off and tried again because I just don't even know what I'm doing. So I'm gonna come in with just a little bit of that transition color, just at the top though. I don't wanna blend my whole crease. I just want this top to blend just a little bit better. Um, I did take my liner shader brush in that purple and did it underneath as well. And then I didn't use my pristine liner. I'll show you which one I used for my under eye. Which color is it? Polished. It's kind of like a silvery. I'm going to show it to you here in a minute. But, okay. Dee, 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 dee. Hmm. 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 Um, I feel like I need some help with this eye, guys. Does anybody want to come over and help me out with this eye? Let's just calm this down just a smidgy bit. There, maybe I did it. Maybe I perfected it. Maybe, maybe I didn't. Here's the thing, if I didn't, no one is going to know and it's gonna be fine. <laughs> um, let's just go a little bit right down there. Guys, this looks different to me. Does it look different to you? I thought this eye looked too dark, and here I go putting some dark in it. <laughs> okay, it's okay, though, because it's fine. Okay, so here's the thing. For those of you who are scared, oh, thank you, Taylor. For those of you who are scared, just don't be. Just don't be. Just keep playing with it, okay? Because um, this is a little bit bolder than what I would wear, typically, but it's still so pretty. I love the lighter eyelids. I'm kind of digging that look right now. Um, so I did, let's see here. Uh, my colors that I chose were Bittersweet and Rapturous for Cream Shadow. So you could choose one or get both of those. Because Kudos is 85 and if you add anything that's $15 or more, you get free shipping. Okay. So this is polished today. Instead of the white, this is kind of like a shimmery, really light, light blue. But it still gives the same effect as that pristine white liner. And that it just kind of makes your eyes a little bolder, a little brighter. I am going to remember today to put on this black before I do my mascara because it becomes a little more difficult after I have mascara on. What this does is make your lashes look a little fuller and a little um, darker, especially at the base where maybe you're not putting as much mascara. Okay? So what do you guys think? Rapturous and bittersweet. And then, oh, my neck itches, guys. Um... I have this necklace and I love it, but I have super, super, super sensitive skin. And for one, it turns my neck green. And for two, it gives me like a rash, but I still wear it because I really like it. Okay, so here's the colors that I use in here. Courageous on the outside and kind of above, and then beaming on the inside corners and up at the highlight and then on the lid. So those are the colors used. And don't forget to top it off with Epic. Epic is a good one to add with this Kudos too to get you that free shipping. Because um, you you need $15. The Epic is $24. It's awesome. Okay. So do front and back of lashes. That's my tip for you today. If you need a tip regarding foundation, um, 
comment add me and I'm going to put you into my beauty blog group um, because today is Tip Tuesday and we talked about foundation this morning and what you do when you are in between your winter and summer shade. Um, like your, your summer shade is just too dark, but your winter shade is just too light. Like what do you do? There's no in between. You still need certain coverage for red or yellow skin tones. Like there's all these things that like you're like, do I have to be a scientist to figure out my winter? Or better yet, do I have to be a scientist to figure out my fall foundation shade? Because we kind of all know what our summer is and we kind of all know what our um, winter is, but who knows what their fall is? So if you need help with that, get in my beauty blog. Just comment, add me, and I will put you in there. Um, I do fun stuff in there, especially on Wednesdays because it's win on Wednesdays. Hey, Audra, how's it going, girl? Hey, Kelly. So whenever I call people out, then it makes me even more nervous because then it makes it real that people are on here. So I should not do that because I like to pretend I'm on here by myself and y'all usually don't comment or anything. So then I really can just pretend that it's just me. <laughs> like I gotta get off here and get a kid out of bed. I gotta make lunches still. There's Epic. You see that? Do you like the eyeshadow? Audra, do you like the purple? Um, you can't really see the shimmer. I feel like I'm so close you guys are seeing nose hairs. Hopefully that's not the case, but here it is guys. So today I chose this palette because it's amazing. I'm going to be using it like every day through Christmas because there are so many different looks I can get with this. Today I chose Swagger Lipstick. Um, this is a bolder color. So I went with this only because every day I've been showing you Upscale, up class, or Affluent because those are some neutral colors. It kind of tones down the eyes, but if you, if you have seen no one but Kyle has seen my outfit today. It's a little out there. I have on a floral jacket. I have on polka dot leggings. I have on a dress. And I have a t-shirt over the dress. <laughs> I'm going to try today to get dried and to take a picture. And I have on like um, white really tall boots. <laughs> the boots that Kyle called hooker boots. They are not though. They're like grandma boots because they are like a... A sweatery material so I don't even know what he was talking about but um so I felt like today because the outfit is a little fun and my shirt that says sorry I'm late but do you see these brows mm-hmm mm -hmm. um so my outfits kind of out there today so I didn't want to tone down my lips we don't always want to tone down our lips right no so today I went with swagger I have seen swagger on blondes brunettes uh, dark, dark black. Um, I have seen it on white skin tones, um, dark skin tones. I mean, everything that you can imagine, I have seen this color on, and it is amazing. It is one of those colors that just transforms you. I am not even playing, guys. It's just like, yay. I don't know. So, you get to choose. A, you get the palette, okay? Then you get to choose the lipstick and a cream shadow, and you get the cream shadow brush. You get all of this for $85. Add an Epic, free shipping. You've just saved $5.50. That's like making your mascara under 20 bucks. That's amazing. Okay, guys. I love you guys, but I have to get off here. I would love to keep chatting with myself because I think I've had two comments. Y'all aren't commenters, are ya? Um, but I gotta get off here because I gotta make lunches. I gotta make my shake. I gotta have time for trying to take a picture of the most fabulous outfit I have probably ever put together. I mean, who doesn't like florals, dresses, polka dots, hooker boots, and a t-shirt and a dress? I don't even know. I don't even know. But I love you guys. And I will see you tomorrow for another fun look. If you have a suggestion on the colors you want me to use out of here, we have this like green, purple, blue, teal. I haven't used this color yet. It's brand new looking. I haven't used it yet. I don't know what to do with it. I need to watch more videos to see what other people are doing with it. Okay? I don't know. Audra, have an amazing day. Um, I love you guys, and I will see you later. <laughs> Bye.